Hey, what is going on guys? So you wanna know how to enable as well as use the screen recording feature that's built in to the iPhone X or XR or XS or XS Max. It's very, very simple. The first thing you gotta do is enable the screen recording feature, okay? So if I go down to my control center here and we can see that once I enable it, we're gonna have another icon here with a little circle. So first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and enable it. So go ahead and go, to, go into your settings here and then from here, you want to scroll down and look for Control Center right here. Tap on that. And then you want to tap on Customize Controls. And then from here, you want to scroll down until you see Screen Recording. Tap on, or go ahead and click on the plus sign, just like that. And then once you tap on that, it's going to show up here. So again, top right-hand corner, if I slide down, now I'm going to see the Screen Recording function right here. Now, I didn't say slide down from the top middle, because then you're going to get this right here. Okay, again, top right-hand side, slide down, and here is the screen recording feature. Now, the thing is, you can also enable the microphone if you want to basically kind of do like a voiceover or give somebody a tutorial on how to get to a certain setting. Or what else you can do too is, for instance, you can record like one of your um, YouTube videos and you, and you want to record like a partial clip and, and talk about it at the same time the video is playing. Or if you wanted to, like let's say you wanted to play a game on here and you also want to give a commentary at the same time, you can do that as well. So let's do this. Let's go ahead and long press uh, the screen recording function here. Just press and hold down for like two seconds and then this will pop up. And this microphone is currently on. I think usually it's by default it's off, but it says microphone off now. Okay, so if we go ahead and click it on, whatever we record from our video, even if the video has sound and everything and we're, to and we're talking, it's gonna record everything at the same time. I'm going to go ahead and leave the uh, record the microphone on right now. So let's go ahead and let's start screen recording right now. So let's say uh, I want to screen record right now. So top right hand corner, slide down, go ahead and tap on the screen recording icon right here. Tap it. It's going to give me a three second countdown to one and boom. As soon as it starts recording, we know that it's recording because we're going to have this up here in the top left hand corner, this timer that's highlighted in red. So from here, I mean, you can do anything you want. You can go ahead and go into settings. Um, if you're talking to somebody, uh, trying to show them how to navigate somewhere, you can go ahead and tell them, click on here, and you want to scroll down. But let's do this, okay? Let's, let me go ahead and just play a game really fast. Let me go into uh, PUBG here. Let me go ahead and click on that. And because I had the microphone on, we're going to be able to hear the sound from the game and also me speaking at the same time. So give us a second to load. Okay, so you can see that I'm playing the game here right now. And the thing is, the volume on the game right now is very, very faint, even if I have it max volume, because I have the microphone, microphone enabled, so I'm speaking and it's recording both. But once I go ahead and stop the uh, screen recording and I watch the saved version, you'll be able to hear what's on here clearly, as well as me talking. But it's very, very faint right now. I don't think you're really able to hear it, but let's do this now. Let's go ahead and stop it. And in order to stop the screen recording, you just simply tap on the top left here where it's highlighted red right there. Just tap on that and it says stop right here and we'll tap on stop. Okay, and now it gets saved into your photos app right here. So we'll go ahead and we'll tap on that. And then if you go ahead and just tap on album, tap on all photos here. And the last one that was saved right here was the screen recording function is two minutes and nine seconds. Let me go ahead and just play this for you. And so you can- and boom, as soon as it starts recording, we know that it's recording because we're gonna have this up here in the top left hand corner, this timer that's highlighted in red. So you hear me talking so on here. here. Now, let me just Good. move to the uh, gameplay here. Okay, so you can see that I'm playing the game here right now. And the thing is, the volume on the game right now is very, very faint, even if I have it max volume, because I have the microphone, microphone enabled, so I'm speaking and it's recording both. But once I go ahead... So you can hear the volume coming from directly from the game that's in my phone and also me talking simultaneously, basically doing a voiceover. So another thing you can also do too, if you go ahead and click on edit here, you can easily trim it as well. You know the beginning part, I basically showed like uh, how to get to the screen recorder and stuff like that. If you wanted to block all that out, and let's say I just wanted to move everything directly to the game where I start talking, like right about here somewhere, I can stop it right there. And if I wanted to trim the ending as well, I can just go ahead and grab it back here and stop it wherever I want, like right here. Then if I press on play. So you can see that I'm playing the game here right now. 
And the thing is, the volume on the game right now is very and then Let me press on pause, and if I want to save it, I will go ahead and click on done here. And I'll save it as a new clip. And now, this will get this new clip will get saved into the Photos app as well. And let me go back into the Photos app. And you can see both the original screen recording video I made and the second one where basically I trimmed it. So pretty simple, very, very easy to do. I hope that helped you guys out. If you guys have any questions or need any assistance, go ahead and comment below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.